Iowa weather is one of the weirdest places on earth. We had five inches of snow overnight. Two days ago, we had tornado warnings come through here. Um, there wasn't any snow and people's houses got blown down. I mean, there was actually people died in Iowa a couple days ago because of the weather. And now we have got this sloppy mess to clean up. My question today is, if you have a tooth bar on your bucket, how often do you take that, put it on and take it off in situations like this? Right? I could have been digging dirt two days ago and now I got to move snow with it. I'm going to leave the tooth bar on, push snow and see if it really makes a difference. Do I have weight in the tires? None. Will I have ballast today? Nope. Will I have any rear attachments on for weight? Uh-uh. Simply just the tractor as is with R4 tires and the bucket. Now, the tooth bar I have is the, what is it called? The Piranha tooth bar. That's what I'm gonna use today. I, one, it doesn't really matter if this works too well because it's gonna be in the 40s in a couple of days, so it'll melt, but let's pretend it was important and live or die, if we don't get the snow moved, we're all gonna die. We'll do our best, but I am not gonna take the tooth bar off. terrible. be the last time I ever have a 2025R pushing snow. I've got to at least try the driveway one more time. I can't leave this like this. Um, if I get stuck, good. At least we'll know. But let's see if we can get this thing stuck.
So did it get the job done? Absolutely it did. Uh, chalk one up for the good guys. If you like videos like this, let me know, man. But if you want more tractor videos, no problem. If you want a sweatshirt like this, go ahead and hit woodwardacres.com and click on the store. Uh, thanks for watching. I'll catch you guys next time.